this started, as I said, a few years ago. It started with the first meeting. Well, it started before, but I think this was really a key event to get uh, a bunch of people together and start getting stuff done. And the cool thing is, all these people are still involved to the point where they are actually here. So I thought it was cool to get these people. Yes. I thought it was super cool to get these people on stage and ask them, you know, why they started this and, you know, a little bit about their motivation and maybe a fun anecdote or two. So, Frank, Arthur, Jan, Icewind, Jacob. So, um, Frank, well, you started, of course, earlier with a keynote, but this was the first time you met uh, your four first uh, collaborators. Any interesting things that happened, or <laughs> I'm sure? Yeah. yeah, thanks a lot. So, um, yeah, I don't have a lot of time, but I mean, the original idea of OwnCloud at the time was, um, was this was announced during the keynote of a KDE event, of, actually, so at the very beginning, no one noticed anymore. Besides some people, that it was actually a KDE project at the beginning. We um, we took different paths then, um, but this was all. It's a lot of people really jumped on board and worked together um, here on mailing lists and on GitHub and other medium. And at some point, I thought, wouldn't it be nice to just email, to send a mail to the mailing list and say, hey, if you maybe we should meet in person, like because we've never met in person before, right? So I said, hey, why don't you come just to my office in Stuttgart for a weekend? And then we hack together, like work on these things. And this is where, yeah, I mean, we all met there for the first time, like here in this, in the, in this room here. And my idea was that, okay, we, everybody arrived on Friday and like in the afternoon or evening. And then, yeah, maybe we go to a pub together. And then over the weekend, we, we talk and do things. But this didn't turn out that, in that way, <laughs> it was actually completely different. So everybody arrived, we sit, we sat there, um, and um, basically start to work. And it actually was the meeting where we basically created like OwnCloud 2.0 at the time. And um, well, I mean, we really barely left this room the whole weekend. <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, now, I, I mean, back then I could not imagine to, to what it really kind of leads, like what we are today and what we are kind of still. Um, um, and purchasing or no, per pursuing, so it was yeah, it's a really cool, really cool event and yeah, super awesome kickoff and it's really awesome to now have this huge conferences and worldwide projects and that's really amazing what we are doing. So it's really cool. Yes, uh, so for me, there were uh, two reasons to contribute to OwnCloud. First one was uh, I was a long-term Linux user and wanted to give something back to the community. And uh, I always thought about, oh, okay, I'm using KDE all the time, so let's do something in the KDE universe. And then Frank came with uh, own cloud and a PHP web app. That's oh, something where I really can contribute because I'm doing this for a long time. And the uh, second reason was basically uh, very selfish. I wanted to host a service for myself, my family, uh, where I can share files, contacts, and uh, calendar entries. So I just wanted to create an app for myself. And well, it worked out pretty fine, <laughs> I must say. <laughs> so from my point of view, uh, OnCloud is feature complete, or NextCloud, as it's called today. And um, I must say, it's an amazing community. And it's really fun to be here every year. And just uh, just ask for an anecdote. So uh, Frank already told the one with uh, five more minutes. The other sentences that still sticks in my mind is, uh, it doesn't make sense. And that was <laughs> Jan as a designer who killed every great idea about configuring everything. And so just that doesn't make sense. Keep it simple. Uh, I think during the meeting I hated him for that, but in the end it turned out he was right. <laughs> yeah, uh, I started working for 
back in the day, they own cloud for two, two main reasons. The first one is the same as with Jakob, that I was a long time KDE and Linux user and wanted to give something back. And then when a PHP project came around, which I'm actually technically able to contribute to, I took the chance. And the second one, which is pretty lucky that it all worked the way at a time, I wasn't really bored, high school student, and I wanted something to do. And here I am, six and a half years later, still having something to do. <laughs> so yes, like I want to thank also all of you and everybody else who's not here who contributed that helped us getting from five people in a small office room to the entire group we have here today. Yeah, so I uh, was at the time, um, yeah, it was more of a coincidence. I was studying in Stuttgart, finishing up my s design studies. And uh, yeah, unlike most designers, uh, I was using some free software. I was using Ubuntu and did some translations for it. But not, yeah, a bit of design, a bit of usability testing. And then, uh, and I was, of course, looking for an alternative yeah, to Dropbox, to Google Drive, because during studies, you use that a lot. And uh, I found, like, by coincidence, yeah, this this email you talked about, um, and yeah, so I saw, oh, okay, next week there's going to be the hackathon, okay, like five people are going to be there, so yeah, I'll join, and um, that's basically the story, um, essentially, and uh, yeah, we had a fun time. The, the anecdote from my side is that there's a second picture um, of this hackathon, like they're both very, very low resolution. And on the other one, I'm on the whiteboard and I'm scribbling something and you can see Frank on the right side and he does like a bit like, like this. <laughs> but yeah, and uh, all in all, it was, uh, it was, yeah, a very cool event. Um, yeah, and, uh, it's, uh, it was a very good start to the project. From what I can tell, it doesn't make sense is still your slogan and, uh, everybody still hates it when you say it, but you always turn out to be right. So nothing changed in that regard. Oh okay, yeah, and of course today, you know, I mean, this is just a couple of the people uh, who are now contributing in our next cloud GitHub repo. Um, it's really amazing, I think, that we've got so far from uh, such a small project. So I want to thank everyone again.